with seven blocks. And Brazil has signaled for a timeout. Game one is dead even at nine. Fought back to tie at nine. Brazil had a two point lead. Leads are hard to come by with the attackers that we have at the Palau San Zordi today. The gold medal at stake. Netherlands and Brazil. Chance for the Dutch. It's 10-9, Netherlands, game one. Definitely Dutch doing it right now with the block. Last three points scored with a stuff. Postema with a big impact in the run. And some faulty passing gives the Dutch their first two-point lead of game one at 11-9. Negron. Nice adjustment. They change their hitters side to side. Go high outside to Negron. He finds the line. Boudry was isolated one on one, and that's not the matchup the Netherlands wants. Sort of scary, actually. Swerver so Dink covered nicely by Brazil. Kanji got it in the corner. Point Brazil. They're within one now at 10 11. Negron and Carlone. And just like that, it's 11 all. Carlone on the outside reaches in with his right hand. Great block. Carlone was first team all Italian league. And he went up and roofed that ball. Brazil has tied it. They're looking for the lead. They have the lead at 12 11. Look for a timeout here, I think. Maurice Sellinger has brought his team to the sideline. So just like that, the 11-9 advantage is wiped out. Brazil sprints to a 12-11, one point precarious lead in game one. And what they do is they get one of their jump servers back. Now it's Tenji doing it. He's back in the back jumps. They get a tough serve. They dig behind it. They have guys that just go up and pound the ball from the back row. Good set, bad set. They go up and pound for points. It's their jump servers. They get one of them back to Negron. Tenji, they get them back there, and they make up points very quickly. Brazil will serve with a 12-11 advantage. And Tanji. Into the net, and it was Carlone. Side out, Netherlands. Negron, the quick attack in the middle. Quick set right there across his body. Great hit. Ten kills for Negron. Swerver finding hands. A dozen kills for Ron Swerver. This is Olaf van der Mullen, the rising star of the Netherlands off the bench. Giovanni paints a winner. 
outside. He goes over the top of the block and down. Everyone's had two set up on the outside, but it didn't seem to bother Giovanni. That one just ticked the net side out. Another one. Big break for the Netherlands. That's a rotation where Brazil scores a lot of points. Negron serving and the block in the front row. Netherlands looking to get even. Down by a point in game one. And Negron again. Well, Mauricio doing a nice job of finding Ivy Tal Selinger in the front row. That's what he wants. Straight down. Selinger setting help. Not a good first pass, but again, the little guy able to adjust. Little 5'9". He looks real small with the, with the trees he's got out there hitting. But he's a 5 beta Kappa player. Always making the right moves. Nacrone thundering one down. It's scary to try to defend him. He is absolutely a big time hitter, I'll tell you. He goes up high, jumps over the top of the block out of the back row. This is not a small block we're talking about. This is not a game for the faint of heart. These guys are bringing it. Like Giovanni. Brazil has assumed on a 13-11 lead. There was a touch, a kill on the spike by Olaf von der Mullen. Angle winner. Well, this coach has done a tremendous job. Jose Roberto Gomerich. He has the Brazilians believing that they're the best in the world. And they're out to prove it today. Swerver has it down. for Brazil to get the 14th point of game one. Brazil's at game point. You break down passing against this team and you're done. 14 serving 11. And the tip by Olaf Vanderbilt. Side out another one. One game point erased. Serve.